Hi everybody, here we are again, uh, looking to do some more indoor activities while we're uh, locked up in the house. We got snow on the ground, not exactly ideal for getting outside and doing some of those outdoor activities that we like to do in, in uh, spring and summer. So today what we're going to do is we're going to do some bocce ball. Uh, my first suggestion is not to use a real bocce ball set inside the house. Mom and dad are not going to appreciate that. So we're going to keep it... Uh, Keep it light, and uh, and what we've done here today is we've just created some bocce balls out of some socks. So I got my team green, I got my team red, just a couple of socks rolled up nice and tight, and uh, a polino. So the game of bocce ball is usually played with four people, kind of two teams of two. Everybody has two balls each. Uh, what we're going to do today is just uh, two players, each with two balls. Uh, we pick a player to, to throw the bocce first, so we'll do some rock, paper, scissors here to see who wins. Oh, so Nash wins. That means he's going to throw the Polino. So, go ahead, Nash. Nice and easy. Toss it out there. Perfect. Okay, so the person that throws the Polino will also throw the first bocce ball. Okay. Oh, that's a nice throw. Pretty tight. Okay, red. So, now what you do is you look to see who's closer. Well, we got the Polino down here. Red looks like they're going to have to throw again because they're further away. Oh, great throw. Green needs a good throw to score. And it looks like he did it for one point. Red is second closest. So that means that green just scores the one. Because red was next closest. Kind of the same type of scoring as in curling. So now the person that scored is going to throw the Polino. Okay, Nash, you scored, you throw the Polino. That's a nice easy toss. Down the hallway, okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, from where you guys are. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Go ahead, Green. Oh, a little heavy on that one. Ah, uh, yikes. You know what? Green's closer. Oh, well, green's closer. Go ahead, Red. Tyson, you're away. Well, that's not terrible. I think Red's closer now. Okay, stay out of the way. Nash has to throw. Oh, we gotta get a real close up. Red. I'm thinking that's Red. So, the score is now 1-1. One, one. What you do is you would just keep throwing the Polino. Person that scores gets to throw first. And uh, I would suggest playing a game to about 11. If you happen to have four people in the house, perfect. Roll up another couple of pairs of socks each and keep playing. Uh, like I said, games to 11. If you want to play longer to 21, perfect. Otherwise, have some fun playing some indoor bocce and try to stay active as much as you can. Okay, thanks. Have fun with that one.